You are watching Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Soap Wesley, the Biolime Mouth, and today on Area DMG, we are unboxing Cold Sept Revolt for the Nintendo 3DS. It's for the 20th anniversary of Cold Sept. We've only gotten um, Cold Sept Second Expansion, which came over here as Cold Sept for the PlayStation 2, and then I think Cold Sept Saga. Other than that, we really haven't gotten or rather received any of these games in this series or any substantial ones so yes all I know is that this is one of those games where people have been like is this gonna get localized is this gonna get localized and it almost never does but NIS and Nintendo seem to uh... yeah Nintendo published by NIS of America kinda like a last story or Pandora's Tower type situation Anywho, let's go ahead and open this puppy up. Well, before we do that, here's the side. Here's the other side, and here's the back. Let's go, here's the top, and here's the bottom. But yeah, let's go ahead and open this up and see what's inside. This is, of course, for the Nintendo 3DS. Yay. And, okay, let's see. Open this up here. It's kind of a sturdy box. Look at that. Inside of this box is pretty sturdy. Okay, we've got... Let's just slide that on out. Oop. Yeah, everything just kind of slid out here. We have... Um, whatever this is, which has... Oh, metal dice. Okay, that's a little odd. Let's actually see what's in here. We have two metal dice. That are both individually wrapped. Hmm, we're gonna open those up because these are actually kind of nice. I mean, hmm. Ooh, they look, they, these are, okay, let me uh, pop these over here and show us a little bit more. One, two, three. Instead of a six, there's uh, this. Okay. And then another one of these dice. These are kind of heavy. Reminds me a bit, I have a uh, full metal 20-sided um, dice that I would only bring if I really don't like the Dungeon Master. <laughs> because, quite frankly, it's like a three-pound metal dice. Yay! And here's this. It says, Book of Scepters. It's got uh, character designs and artwork by Kinyo Nishimura. Contains spoilers. Okay. Actually, let's see. Pretty nice. It shows a bunch of the characters. And since there's a lot of spoilers in there, I'm not going to open that up. Sorry about that. Oh, and then we have the foil card set. Which... Ooh, that's shiny. Here's the front part. Here's the shiny parts. Pretty sweet artwork, actually. And it's from the cards. Okay, uh, let's see. Cult Step Revolt foil card set. Let's pop those back in. <laughs> well, whatever. So we have the art set, a book, a pretty nicely put together box. I mean, look at that box. And that box is, you know, pretty stable. Okay. CD, Symphony of Scepters. Here's the backing of it. And let's go ahead and pop that open, too, while we're here. I do not have a good way to open this, because it's... God, CDs. You know what I mean, right? CDs. Those are the hardest things to open sometimes. I had a little tool, actually, that you slide on the um, edge of it to get that out. Oh, oh they, hey, we got it. think we got it. There we go. There we go. And... More packaging. Anyways, here's the, in, here's the front of that. Here's the inside. Here's the track listings. Let's see, Revolt, Striving for Hope. There's 20 of them in there. Music is composed by Kenji Ito, Chiami Takano, 
Kenshi Ito, Yuki Watanabe, um, Chayemi Takano, Yuki, Yuki Watanabe, and uh, Kenji Ito for the most part. There's the backing of that, front of the disc. And here's the actual game. Okay. Coldcept is a weird semi board game style RPG. Let's, uh, come on, anytime this wants to break open. Okay, come on, we can do this. There we go. There we go. A world of strategy awaits. Battle with over 400 cards. Customize your experience. Enjoy over 40 hours of story in quest mode. Challenge your friends online or locally. This has local play and multiplayer local. Versus co-op play, two to four players. Internet versus co-op play, two to four players. Spot pass. I do not think this is download play, but we'll check. Mm -hmm. This is just a little thing to tell you how to access the uh, the um, online manual, rather the game, the digital manual. And here is the game cartridge with the same artwork as the front. So this is what comes with Cold Sept Revolt. Nice. I like these dice. That's pretty sweet. But yeah, let's see. We get the uh, box to hold everything in. Dice. A, an art book with spoilers, so I'm not going to show those off. The foil card set. The game. And a soundtrack. But yeah, these are kind of nice. But yeah... People have described this as kind of a weird cross between uh, Monopoly and D&D. &D. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, let me know in the comments below, have you played any of these before? Like, um, like the PlayStation 2 one or the Xbox 360 one? Have you imported this game before? Are you one of those people who's looking forward to this game? We know you're out there. Uh, what do you think of the stuff that comes with it? Let me know in the comments below. Hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. Hit that share button if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Oh, and if you hit the subscribe button, make sure that you also ring that little bell. Yeah, so that you are notified whenever we have a brand new video here at Area DMG. And until the next video comes out, you are now caught up.